Hi guys sports here news briefs. Messi offered 1 million euros for Bishti War to lift trophy. Nadal reveals tears for Messi and hope that Mbappe will make Real Madrid move. Jordi Alba set to stay at Barcelona. Inter Milan's Andre Onana leaves Cameroon. Kidi Bear to undergo surgery for an ankle injury. Papu Gomez to return to Sevilla injured. England star Sam Curran makes history at IPL auction. Hertz headlines eight Eagles selections for revamped Pro Bowl. Now the news in detail. Messi offered 1 million euros for Bishti War to lift trophy. A member of Oman's parliament has offered Lionel Messi, $1 million, or £828,000, for the Bishti War during Argentina's World Cup celebrations. Lionel Messi, recently crowned World Cup champion with Argentina, has been offered a healthy sum for the Bisht which he wore during the trophy lifting ceremony after beating France. After he was encouraged to wear the traditional Qatari clothing item, which the World Cup organizers came out later to say is normally worn for special occasions and celebrations, it caused a stir in the world of football, with many accusing the host country of spoiling the main event of the final, as the Daily Mail say. Just shy of a week later, someone has come forward to offer the man from Rosario 1 million euros for the garment. According to the Daily Mail, it is Ahmed Al Barwani, member of the Oman parliament, who offered the Argentine the hefty sum of money for the now historical piece of clothing. Nadal reveals tears for Messi and hope that Mbappe will make Real Madrid move. Rafael Nadal has revealed he had tears in his eyes as Lionel Messi led Argentina to World Cup final glory. Even for Real Madrid fan Nadal, there was a joy in seeing former Barcelona talisman Messi achieve his greatest feat at an age when some doubted he would ever lift the trophy. Now 35, Messi was the driving force behind Argentina's success in Qatar. He scored two goals as Sunday's final against France ended in a pulsating 3-3 draw, plus a penalty in the shootout that followed, clinching the golden ball as the tournament's outstanding player. For Nadal, who won his 22nd Grand Slam two days after turning 36 in June, seeing another person achieving late career success is something to which he can relate. Messi lifting the World Cup made me happy. That someone so great culminates with a title that was missing, of this caliber, with all that it means for Argentina, it seemed fair to me, Nadal said. I enjoyed it and I was moved. Without siding with Argentina, when Messi scored the third goal tears came to my eyes. Jordi Alba set to stay at Barcelona. Barcelona are counting on Jordi Alba next season reports Albert Roger of Relevo. The 33-year-old has been competing with youngster Alejandro Balde to be Xavi's first-choice left-back over the last couple of months and questions were raised whether he would stay at the now camp beyond this season. However, it appears as though Barcelona's management have no intention of parting ways with the veteran. The Spaniard's contract with Barcelona is valid until June 2024 and it is believed that he will stay at the club until at least that time. His situation has been compared by many to the one of Gerard Piquet, but it seems as though he is committed to staying at Barcelona. If Sergio Busquets and Sergi Roberto end up leaving the club, he is expected to become Barca's next captain. Inter Milan's Andre Onana leaves Cameroon. Andre Onana's career with Cameroon has come to an end. The Inter Milan goalkeeper has announced that he will not play for his national team again after being excluded from the 2022 World Cup in Qatar due to disagreements with Rigobert Song. Inter Milan goalkeeper Andre Onana left the World Cup in Qatar because of disagreements with coach Rigobert Song. The goalie has announced in a message posted on his Twitter account that he will not play for his national team again. Kidi Bear to undergo surgery for an ankle injury. Espanol midfielder Kidi Bear has suffered an injury to his right ankle and will have to undergo surgery on Friday. The Catalan club did not specify a period of absence and stated that his progress will determine his availability. In any case, it is a long-term absence. The Albanian midfielder is a key player for his coach Diego Martinez.
he has played 12 competitive matches this season. Papu Gomez to return to Sevilla injured. The Argentinian player's mother told the Argentine press that the striker will be out for a month. The misfortunes continue to follow one after the other at Sevilla. The Spanish side had 13 absentees against Juventud de Torremolinos, including Isco, who terminated his contract on Wednesday. However, one of the players who was expected to recover by the end of December will have to rejoin the squad later. We are talking about Papu Gomez, whose reunion with his teammates will be later than expected. England star Sam Curran makes history at IPL auction. England all-rounder Sam Curran has become the most expensive player in the history of the Indian Premier League auction after Punjab Kings paid almost £2 million for his services. Curran's record-breaking deal made him the hottest property during a six-way bidding war in Kerala, with Test captain Ben Stokes and Harry Brook close behind as they both scored deals well in excess of £1 million from Chennai Super Kings and Sunrises Hyderabad respectively. Curran's stock has never been higher after he starred in England's T20 World Cup triumph in Australia last month, picking up the player of the tournament and player of the final double, and his was the name on everybody's lips as bidding got underway in Kerala. Hertz headlines eight Eagles selections for revamped Pro Bowl. The Philadelphia Eagles lead the selections for next year's revamped 2023 Pro Bowl games, with the All-Star match moving to flag football from contact action. The NFL leaders, who sit among the favorites for the Super Bowl with a 13-to-1 regular season record in 2022, have seen eight players picked for the event. Quarterback Jalen Hurts headlines a list of Eagles names that also includes wide receiver A.J. Brown, guard Landon Dickerson, and offensive tackle Lane Johnson among others. Six NFL teams have at least five players selected for the Pro Bowl which will take place on February 5 at the Las Vegas Raiders Allegiant Stadium, a week out from Super Bowl 57. Hertz will start for the NFC selection against Patrick Mahomes, with the Kansas City Chiefs man headlining a seven-strong selection from his franchise in the AFC group. Other teams well represented include the Dallas Cowboys with seven, the Baltimore Ravens and San Francisco 49ers with six and the Minnesota Vikings with five. The league previously confirmed Los Angeles Rams defensive lineman Aaron Donald had made his ninth consecutive Pro Bowl, despite injury struggles that have curtailed his campaign. He is joined by Travis and Jason Kels, who become the first pair of brothers to earn simultaneous selection for a record fifth time. The two teams will be coached by a set of siblings in former Super Bowl winners Peyton and Eli Manning too with the duo having earned 18 Pro Bowl selections between them in their playing days. For more sports updates please keep watching our YouTube channel Sportsia or visit our Twitter handle.